What's going on guys? It's your boy Tor. Just back for another video. It looks like we've got news on accessories coming out to the game. We've got the Misanga, traditional Quincy Garp, Ramen, Quincy Cross, and Ginto. So these are uh, the new accessories we're getting. Uh, pretty exciting stuff. I've already read in, uh, in on it basically. Uh, what you've got is the, uh, doo -doo -doo -doo, the Ginto and the Quincy Cross. So the Ginto and Qu Quincy Cross um, what, each one of those is going to include or you know will have the normal attack damage increase and the strong attack damage increase those are like the lieutenant's badge and the wooden sword for the soul reapers so that's essentially what this is for pretty cool stuff man we actually did need those those are something we desperately needed um, and then we've got the ramen which reduces uh, laceration duration and the traditional quincy garp which increases the stamina for quincy's and stern riggers so basically like the captain's robe so pretty cool stuff the last one that's in the middle which is the misanga that one's the one that was kind of throwing it threw me off i honestly thought we were only getting quincy accessories maybe like the ramen kind of something we needed right or not needed but i kind of saw coming but misanga i didn't increases killer effects and has a greater effect during brave battles so as you guys hear that like how you heard it right there is this is going to be exactly better for brave battles um, it's gonna be something that it looks like could definitely change the meta man because increasing killer effects is kind of big man like already alone characters will typically have a 20% increase on either Roncar, Hollow or Soul Reapers or you know no affiliation things like that right so if that increases with this that's gonna be pretty clutch man something different and then especially if it's an extra increase to Brave Battles I'm thinking this will still go into effect and it'll still be a decent accessory like in PvE content but if it's more in Brave Battles, that's going to be pretty insane, man. That's going to be big, big, right? Uh, you know, like a gold choppy, regular choppy, and then this right here. That might be nasty, bro. That might be nasty. Uh, so, yeah, pretty exciting stuff. This That Misanka is obviously only going to be available through tickets or summoning on the machines. The rest are going to be available through uh, fusing or tickets, of course. So, pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Um looking at it here i mean this is basically yeah just gonna just basically notifying you that it's gonna be available in the uh in the summons so um yeah i mean pretty cool bro pretty cool other than that uh we've got a little bit of news on the characters uh for Mo movie round two as you all know it's the rest of the movie characters so you've got like kusaka toshiro yang yang dark rukia homura shizuku Hom homura and shizuku and then kisuke uh, so those are the characters in the ticket. This is the ticket, but the, the summons are available as well So um, you can summon for them or you can buy the ticket personally. I might buy the ticket since I'm missing three of them um, But yeah, that's that's basically it. I don't really think I need to dive deep into it again Movie characters will have those same exact characters. We just looked at plus a few other fillers So I mean up to you guys if you want to summon I would suggest don't go too deep if you are but that ticket again if you are missing either all or three like me maybe maybe try it out uh but anyways i appreciate you all so much for watching man Ex exciting stuff with the accessories man that's definitely exciting let me know what you guys think about those accessories and you know kind of what your thoughts are on that new one that uh misanga i believe is the name that one kind of threw me off but what do you think about that is that going to be like game changing yeah anyways appreciate it and uh, catch you on the next one peace